Hello everyone and welcome to vlog number 5 of 5 technology vlogs. Today I will be reviewing many ways to close a window in Windows 7. Some of you may already know this, so if you do just turn off this video and drop a like. For those of you who don't, I'll show you right after this. Okay, here we are. To start off, everybody should know this. Of course, on the top right hand side, I think, yeah, you see a red X. Everybody should know that. If you don't, then you may want to get that checked out. Yeah, so if this is the default option. It's on, technically on every window that you see. Yeah, so that's the, the number one default one. And I just close that. The second way you could do it, of course, on the right left I mean I need to work on my left and right and whatever. yeah you just see this icon right here you just click that and obviously you'll see an option that says close I have a little X right there as well and alt F4 which we will get to a later you just click that and there you go there's number two number three um you just it's kind of the same over here but instead you double click this you, yes you double click this window like for example I'm gonna pull a random window up over here you just, even though you don't see the icon right here, you just double click it, and then it'll X out. There is your Mac OS X option. So now let's um, close this window like a Mac, except the fact it's double clicking. Another option, of course, you can use the taskbar. Yes, you can use the taskbar. It's, this was introduced in Windows 7. So when you go over here, you'll see like an arrow peak preview, whatever. For you see X right there. You obviously just click that X and then it'll X out your window. Another way you can do it is the taskbar again by right clicking the taskbar. But obviously, it'll say close all windows, so you won't be able to close one window at a time. So that's the way how it is with Windows 7. That's another way you could do it as well. Another way you could do it is um, you can use a shortcut key by pressing Alt F4 on your keyboard. And I know you can't see my keyboard, but if you press Alt F4, unnecessary <coughs> is not there, but Alt and F4, it'll be up here, like around 4. Then you just click that, and then it'll obviously close out the window. Right now, I'm gonna close out the window. And there you have it. There is um, some ways you can close out a window. This was a really short um, vlog. Yeah. There you have it, um, and I'll see you guys.